Hey guys, what's up? Passe Baller here. We are now on this, I don't know, 13th game? <laughs> 13th game for today, uh, November 7, 2022. And then we have 15 games for today. So just hang in there, guys. We still have two more. Right? So this is Sacramento Kings with a record of three wins and five losses. Uh, visiting Golden State Warriors, displaying a record of three wins and seven losses. You heard me right, seven losses. Um, by the way, the game will be at uh, 10 o'clock p.m. Eastern Time, and that will be at 11 o'clock a.m. here in Manila. I'm just inviting everyone who have not subscribed yet to our YouTube account or YouTube channel, Passai Baller, please click on the subscribe button below. At the same time, hit on that bell logo. That way, automatically, you guys will be receiving notifications whenever new videos are uploaded. All right, here we go. By the way, let's check on the spread because um, it's been moving, man. I've been I've been watching the spread and it's been moving for pretty much the you know all of the teams. But let's take a look at this one. Um, as we speak, it is at minus seven point five. Again, that's minus seven point five in favor of Golden State Warriors. So we got to give it to the whole team. Golden State Warriors. Let's take a look at the standings, the Western Conference standings. Man, this is crazy. Sacramento Kings, they're ranked number 12, all right? So they're not doing good. Golden State Warriors, guess what? They're actually even ranked number 13. So when was the last time uh, that you would see um, these two teams going at it? Or They don't have to really go at it, but when was the last time that you would see Sacramento Kings having a better record than <laughs> than Golden State Warriors, right? I couldn't remember, for real. Um, so, whatever happened to Golden State War Warriors, man, I don't know. All right, so let's uh, break this one. Um, for, Go for Golden State Warriors, they got the home court advantage. In terms of momentum, we got to give it to Sacramento Kings. I was watching that game against the uh, Orlando Magic. You know, they had to bounce back. Uh, they had to go to OT. And then there you go. The Aaron Fox hitting that long three-point shot, giving them the win. So approaching this game, Sacramento Kings is coming off that win. While for Golden State Warriors, man, oh man, are they having a losing streak or what? They are on a five-game winning streak. Am I right? Is it five games? Yes, it's a five-game, not winning, losing streak for Golden State Warriors. Not really used to say five-game losing streak for Golden State, but it is what it is right now. Um, in terms of fatigue, well, both teams had their rest last night, so we can just skip that part. And perhaps let's go straight to the uh, uh, to the injury list for both teams. All right, so let's start with Golden State Warriors. I see Iguodala and DiVincenzo still out. Um, Andrew Wiggins and Stephen Curry, they're both listed as day-to-day, uh, -day, or game-time decision. Highly likely they will play... Um, most of most of the starters of Golden State Warriors did not play, uh, you know, the, um, the last time that you know the last time that Golden State uh, had a game. So I'm pretty sure that uh, that's the rest that you know the coaching staff wanted to give their stars. Now um, let's go to Sacramento Kings. I'm not seeing anything here because you know what? It's a good news. You know, Sacramento Kings they don't have any. Um, anyone in the injury list at all. So, well, with that said, uh, Sacramento Kings would also have the advantage in terms of uh, health. Now, here uh, it's kind of hard to decide which you know which team, which, which team to pick, especially with the kind of spread of uh, seven point five. That's kind of big. Um, well, first off, I really feel like Golden State Warriors would win this one. Um, five game losing losing streak is already a weird thing. Uh, especially for uh, a defending champion, right? Um, and they're they're complete, right? It's not like two of their stars are missing and all that. They are complete. They're they're they've just been losing, even even against Orlando. <laughs> so they've had this rest. Um, stars were rested on that game. Uh, they already had uh, this rest last night. They are at home, so I guess Golden State Warriors will be back to reality, or will be back to normal. Hopefully, alright? Oh, no. I mean, I really feel like Golden State Warriors will win this game. The only question is whether they would be able to cover it or not. Because uh, Sacramento Kings, uh, they're a team you know, that won't stop. That won't stop playing. I mean, that's a good proof. That last game against uh, Orlando Magic, Magic already had it by like, I don't know, 20 points. Magic was already up by, by a lot. But Sacramento Kings, you know, kept on fighting and 
they ended up, you know, bringing home the W. Um, 7.5, it is big, but I guess we would see um, the, the the normal or the usual Golden State Warriors uh, this you know, this particular game. They are at home. They would get the support that they need. They've been, you know, uh, they've been resting. Of course, they've heard what they needed to hear from the, you know, from the from the management and from the coaching staff. I really feel like Golden State Warriors will be Golden State Warriors in this game, covering the spread of minus seven point five. So that's where we would be. Golden State Warriors minus seven point five. Peace out. Pasay love and God bless.